All right, let's get into chapter four. Looks can be deceiving. Level 31, Roadhogs, a new stop during the O'Malley's road trip and a new adventure. So, where are we going again? Rosa's restaurant in Carlsbad. Carlsbad. She contacted me through the blog asking for help with her restaurant. There it is! You're just helping everyone who contacts your blog? Okay. <laughs> I mean, cool, but what? Hi! Can we get some menus? Sure. Down the block and on the right. Um, uh, your menus are down the street? No, but that's where you can get some menus at the fancy new brew pub they built. We don't have menus. We serve two things. Chili and burgers. Or chili burgers, if you're feeling adventurous. Three chili burgers, please. Grill's broken. Roadhogs, Roadhogs, Roadhogs. Roadhogs, Roadhogs, Roadhogs. Pipe down! Can't you see I got customers? Ah, uh, yes, I totally understand why your place is going so well. Sorry, Rose, but it's time for our meeting. Roadhogs, Roadhogs, Roadhogs. Roadhog, Roadhog! Why don't you grab a seat while I help Rose and find us all something to eat? Serve customers within 30 seconds. And you start already now? You're not even giving me a chance! I don't even know where everything is. Wow, she's just like DJing or something. Nice. Actually not. Never mind. My bad. On table. Oh yeah.
Hey Rose, how about another round? Hold your horses, Rob. So, Rose, I didn't introduce myself. I'm Emily. Emily O'Malley, you emailed me about your restaurant? Huh, you're a bigger fool than I am, then. This place looks like it has a lot of history. We used to be the heart and soul of this corner of the state. We've had important people come all, from all around, local celebrities, the mayor. Let's just say that our clientele has gone downhill somewhat. Your attitude is not helping. Uh, Patrick, why don't you grab your tools and see what you can do with that grill? Sweetheart, I love how you always want to help. I do. Really? But this place is kind of a dump and our kids are at a biker meeting. I mean, some bikers drive around. Isn't there there's some gang that like protects abused children, but no, I, I get it. But sure, I get his point. Like I know, there are a lot of stereotypes and stuff. They don't seem like bad sorts to me, Patrick. Let's just stay and help for a little while, okay? Maybe you'll feel different once we've gotten to gotten to know them. <sighs> Alright. Thank you, sweetie. Wow, Emily is really easy to take advantage of. Like, okay. Like, I'm not saying don't help people, but I'm like, okay. Challenge 4-1. Broken register. The cash register is broken and the repairman is on vacation. We'll just have to make do. Okay. Oh, I guess it breaks sometimes. Another table is being used. Oh, this is like a whole other station. Oh, this is the grill, I guess. Interesting. Oh, I see. What was that? Right? What was that? Double click? Like, what's going on? I know, everyone is like angry, but like, I, I can't fix the. Guess I have to double click it?
I mean, this has to be a bug, right? Like, is it supposed to behave like that? No way. Oh my god, why people stuck on my god, why people stop? Whoa, we unlocked crisps. I know, we're not gonna make it to three stars, cause like... <gasps> wow. Damn. Yep. Okay. Level 32, Patrick versus Grill! Patrick is trying to fix Rose's grill, but his tools keep disappearing. Um, that's not great. Okay. So we have dips, guacamole, and then we have sour cream, beer, beer, and stout beer. Darts, darts, professional darts. Oh, the nuts, the snacks. Okay, so the nuts are now crisps. Um, I don't think there's anything new. Okay, so wait a minute. Hammer, saw, um, tongs, whatever. Monkey wrench? Or wrench. Screwdriver. Well, the good news is your grill isn't too different from the one Emily use, used to use at her restaurant, so I think I've identified the problem. Fortunately, we'll need some new crossover tubes to fix it. The manufacturer that made that grill went out of business. Parts are hard to come by. And expensive. You know, the tubes are the problem, but the rest of the grill doesn't look long for this world. Ever think about replacing it? Can't even afford to replace the coffee maker. Tell you what, do you have the owner's manual for the coffee maker? Let me see what's going on there, and then we'll think up some solutions. Suit yourself, but trust me, that thing's a lost cause. Just like the rest of this place. Where the heck did my screwdrivers go? Find all of Patrick's tools. Oh, just like this. Boom. Yes, I want crisps, please. No, I don't need to click like that. But... Right, there is a car here. There we go. Oh, 
know. Wow, you just had to. <laughs> There's a lot of things. Tip, quick, full order. <laughs> Uh. Also interesting that they call it crisps here, like did this game suddenly turn British? Like in the US it's called chips. Mostly that I know of, but chips in the UK are what's called fries in the US. So chips becomes crisps. Or whatever. Just different words don't become. We call it chips or ships in Swedish. Rose, I looked at some of the photos you have on the wall. How old is this place? My great-grandparents opened this place in 1910. It's still the original building. It survived fires, prohibition, even a riot. Now, after serving the community for over a hundred years, it's in danger of closing down. On my watch, no less. I saw in some of the newspaper clippings you framed that you won a lot of chili cook-offs. <sighs> Used to do it every year. It was a big draw, but that's another tradition that's gone by the wayside. My grill's broken and when my mother passed, so did our best cook. That does suck though. Alright, that's it for this episode. So thank you all very much for watching and I'll see you.